Hello and welcome to my home on week 10 of the COVID-19 lockdown. For those that don't know me, I'm Charmaine Slade from Haverhill Methodist Church in the UK and I will be leading our service today. Get yourself a coffee, maybe something to eat and uh, you, you're very welcome, you're very welcome, especially if church is something that is new to you. Today we will focus on Jesus' last prayer to his father before he went to be crucified. He asks that he be glorified by name and glorified through his disciples. What does it mean to glorify his name? And how do we do that, especially now, when life is really so dark? I'm going to start by reading Psalm 95, verse 1 to 7. Sing joyful songs to the Lord. Praise the mighty rock where we are safe. Come to worship him with thankful hearts and songs of praise. The Lord is the greatest God, King over all other gods. He holds the deepest part of the earth in his hands, and the mountain peaks belong to him. The ocean is the Lord's, because he made it, and with his own hand he formed the dry land. Bow down and worship the Lord our Creator. The Lord is good and the Lord is our God, and we are his people, the sheep that he takes care of in his own pasture. Amen. Let's now pray together. Lord of all glory, we come before you seeking your wisdom that we may glorify you through our thinking, seeking your love. That we may glorify you through our emotions, seeking your strength. That we may glorify you at all times, seeking your perseverance. That we may glorify you in all places. Show us how to live that our lives shine with your glory. And those who encounter us may know you and that you are at work in your world. Amen. We're now gonna hear two hymns, Waymaker and followed by Shout to the Lord. We're then gonna hear our New Testament reading from Claire 